What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Undisputed Pitbulls. Showing y'all the little puppers. They just turned four weeks. Uh, yesterday. Doing great, striving, getting older. That, uh, where's she at? Oh, I think that's her right there. That blue fawn female still. My top contender right now who uh, I'm going to pick. But surprisingly, all the girls, I think that's three of them right there. All of them are pretty much the same size. It's, and it's kind of really, I mean, still early to choose, but, you know, I'm very happy with this litter. They all seem pretty consistent, not too far off from each other, from the smallest to the biggest. But, um... Yeah, I wanted to get on here and, and talk about um, something one of my, uh, my my clients had mentioned to me today or earlier. He had uh, he, he dropped a deposit on a pup. And of course, like all new clients, you know, he's eager to meet his new puppy that's on the way. One of these one of these males. And he asked me if uh, he asked me if. He could uh, get a pup earlier. Like maybe uh, five weeks. And I told him no. And he said, why not? And I told him because they're in school. <laughs> and then he said, what do you mean? I said, this right here is school. This is puppy socialization one-on-one. -on -one. From the time when they're two weeks all the way up to, to seven weeks, eight weeks, maybe 10, they are in school. This point in their development is very important. You see, what's going on right now is they're all trying to figure out what they can and what they can't get away with, with each other. They're testing each other right now. See what I'm saying? And he's, he's, he's pushing her, trying to figure out <laughs> what she would allow. So he's playing, but she's letting him know that she's not with it. And that's important. You know what I'm saying? Because dogs do grow up and they tend to be pushy towards other dogs and never get taught these corrections, especially if you grab them early at four weeks and put them in a home where there's no other dog around and it's just them. It's like no one's there to teach them. And you as a human can't, or as an owner can't teach them the things that a dog would teach them. Dogs are their own first trainers. You see what I'm saying? Before a human trains a dog, a dog trains a dog. <laughs> and I know I got to buy more cedar tops for this, for this ground right here. What's up, girl? Such a cutie. You're such a cute little XL pit bull puppy. You're such a cute little pit bull. Feisty little girl. You see, that's all they're doing. They're testing each other, trying to figure out what they can and, can and, get, can and can't get away with. And then this is how when they get older, they are more well behaved because of these socialization skills. So all the biting, the scratching, the, the, the dominant postures that they keep displaying against each other, it's all necessary. The MMA, the grappling, that's that's to learn how to defend themselves in real life situations. That's another thing. Not only do you want good behavior, but you want your dog to be able to put, uh, to defend himself just in case they do get in the situation. I like that boy over there with the white paws and the stripe down his face. He's nice. He has a nice wide chest. What's up, girl? What? What? What can I do for you today? What? What you want? A little cutie? You such a little cutie. You such a little cutie. You know you a cutie. You a cutie too. All you guys are cute. But um, yeah, I just want to let you guys know that that puppy socialization begins with their brothers and sisters and their mother, of course, too. But um, that's why it's important that you don't get pups until they're 10 weeks, eight weeks old. 
That's very important. These these skills that they're learning right now is it's very important. From learning what's acceptable to also learning um, body body control, how to defend themselves, how to get a pup off them, how to get a dog off them, how to tell a dog, hey, back up. These are all things that are very important. You gotta feed these guys some. Let's put them on mush. Well, now they've transitioned to Kevin, really, now. They have four weeks, going on to five weeks on. What's up, boy? What's up, man? <laughs> All right, guys. I hope you guys have a good one. That's a little short film. <laughs> Say goodbye, guys. <laughs>